everybody and welcome on board this Fairline Tiger 40 for a tour around her interior and glorious virtual reality. So what does that mean to you? Well that means all you need to do is click and drag and swipe your screen around and around wherever you like, whenever you like. You can look around and see where you like when you want to. You don't have to look where I'm looking. And we hope that this really amazing new tech will allow you to feel what it's like to be on this boat without actually being here. How cool! Okay, so here we are, we're in the middle of the boat, or midships, both ways are just about. Um, we're in this saloon here, and you can see we've got loads of head height here. I'm five foot nine, so there's well over six feet. Just notice a nice handrail here, so that's going to be great for getting along the boat in uh, rough weather or if we're bouncy bouncy. And a nice hatch up here also with a blind on there as well. Very nice touches indeed. Everywhere you look on this boat, there are nice touches, I can guarantee you. So when you come down the companion way, lovely and easy to get down. We have a handle around the corner to hold on to. We've got a grab rail to hold onto here, and I have just noticed this, as I mentioned, so lovely. Uh, four nice steps to get down, all coated with whipped carpet here. Now this is, uh, that looks as new, and the owner has got the old ones that fit on top, and he also has some covers fit, that fit on top also. So doubly protected, which is, which is why it looks great. It's looped carpet and it looks absolutely lovely. And it carries on throughout the boat, apart from where we have the uh, the wood inside, which look, also looks lovely. Now, if I just look down here, you can see that we've got the whipped carpet, looks absolutely fantastic. And guess what? This is a protector for the whipped carpet underneath. So really fantastic. And also this cover covers up one or two um, en ex entrances down to the bilge or hatchways to get into the bilge. So it just gives you that really nice finished off look and of course it's protecting the carpet underneath as well absolutely fantastic not seen that before really love it and that happens in there and in there as well I believe just to be confirmed but uh, the rest of this compartment you, you can see over on the port side here we have access to the aft cabin where we're going in a minute lovely long round sofa very nice uh, fold in halfable uh, saloon table there and behind you or over there on the port side we can see we've got a, a range of cupboards there we go we can open those up plenty of room in there for all your bits and pieces Opening windows, we have uh, an opening hatchway down there just under the flower pot, which I can't move because of the flower pot. The upholstery looks great, smells great down here, the headline is good too, the uh, the bulkheads look fantastic. Really very, very special boat and she's been really, really well looked after. Over on the starboard side you can see we've got the galley, so straight down from the companionway into the galley. And by the way, we do have a bin compartment under there, very uh, very powerboat-esque, no problem. Uh, we're into the, uh, the galley, now you can see we have a wooden floor, we have a wooden... Uh, doors, we've got a stainless, uh, we've got Corian by the looks of it, and it all just looks fabulous. So the first thing we encounter when we get down here, we have a nice big cupboard here, we've got a good sized uh, fridge there as well with a freezer compartment, more drawers here, uh, cooker, microwave, and uh, drawers underneath there too. And going around the top, uh, we've got a drying area here, we've got a twin sink unit here, hot and cold running water, and on top we have got the, uh, the twin burner there, and we've got two opening windows also, which uh, really gets the air through this boat. Cupboards behind, sorry to show you my back, Cupboards behind again for more bits and pieces. A TV just right out of the way, but really convenient for the saloon, I think. And generally speaking, all looking fantastic. Finished off by the electrical panel and the generator control panel, generator controls and the uh, stereo there. So all really handy for serving food that way, bringing it back. Really handy for serving food and drinks that way and bringing it back. Really, really wonderful. Love this boat. She's absolutely, she's a peach. Right then, let's pick you up and we'll move you forwards and we'll take you through this door here and see what we find. Well, I know we're going to find the heads compartment, so here we go, Jack and Jill, so anybody can get into this compartment, whoops, without, uh, without disturbing the other people in the other compartment, so that's really, really handy. And you can see we have a shower on the right-hand side here, the aft end with a proper shower cubicle there, there, the shower heads up there, so all the water will stay in there and disappear off forever. Uh, we have the toilet, which is facing to port. We have the sink, which is at the forward end. Storage underneath as well, and uh, really, really handy. Massive, great big uh, cupboard there for all your bits and pieces to keep it away when we're bouncing. And a big mirror that runs along the top there. And an opening window, very nice compartment, very accessible by everybody. And uh, yeah, does what it says on the tin, just like the galley. Let's pick you up again, and I'll come out of here and close the door. And I'll be careful as we just close that door, because I think the head door is still open. So let's close that door, and I'll place you on the bed there. Hopefully you won't fall over. Now you're in the middle of the berth, lovely and wide, lovely and long. It's an island berth, so we can climb into the side. 
either side without having to clamber along the bed or clamber over a partner. You can see we've got padding either side or headboard all the way around. It looks lovely. Head, the headlining looks lovely. Woodwork looks great. We've got shelves either side. We've got storage either side as well. Opening windows and an opening hatch with a blind there as well. What more could you ask for in a luxury cabin? We've got uh, a nice big locker there for hanging bits and pieces in. A vanity area, mirror, uh, shelf there, etc. All looking absolutely fabulous and uh, stereo speakers either side as well by the looks of it. So uh, yeah, really, really lovely. Hope you enjoyed looking at that. So let's pick you up again and we'll walk back through the saloon and I'll take you to uh, the last compartment down here on this lovely boat. And I'll just place you right, see if I can balance you there slightly precariously if you fall over I do apologize but you're in the aft cabin here so what do we have down here well when we come in lovely full-size lobby here with a hatch it's not it's a window up there but with a, a blind over it so we can keep the uh, the light out if you want to if we want to get washed and shaven here we can do we have a sink with hot running hot and hold hot and cold down here cupboards above and a cupboard beneath as well plenty of room here there's a lounge and lovely lounge seat here again with great upholstery on this boat if we want a bit of privacy we want to sit and read or if we're just pulling our fowlies on or if we're just perhaps getting changed now of course the uh, the headroom is uh, compromised above here because we have the cockpit seating above us but that's okay we'll only ever be sleeping in here but looking from the top down good headlining with curtains all round looking brilliant we've got uh, opening windows either side an opening window to the cockpit there too big headboard that goes all the way around the aft and the starboard side of the bed a shelf at the far end i think uh, from here it looks like we have an inset speaker there too and two twin beds a little bit lower down but looking very very nice and comfy to me now here i have I've got a great big mirror which uh, is on the front of a lovely big hanging locker and some more storage here and a shelf behind me with more curtains absolutely wonderful and the carpet looks great too fabulous hey so let's pick you up i'll take you back to the saloon where we'll just uh, finish off i'll sum up by saying that this has been tim from bowshed drop brokers just taking you for a quick tour in virtual reality of the interior of this fairline tiger 34 just go to bowshed brighton and eastbourne Yacht, yacht Brokers on YouTube for lots more virtual reality videos of all types of boats from the tiniest, dirtiest little fishing boats to the most biggest, the biggest, most beautiful and expensive June palaces in Brighton and Eastbourne. Thanks for watching. See you soon.